On to some new information on security changes coming to the trolleys here in San Diego County. Just hours ago, the board of directors with MTS voted to approve a series of measures to improve operations and increase safety on board. Our Zara Barker explains how it will affect your next ride. More security and safety measures are riding their way to the Metropolitan Transit System. The MTS board voted unanimously Thursday to increase staff in an effort to make transit rides safer. The motion passes unanimously. This vote will increase staff by 34 inspectors, six supervisors, five dispatchers, and two other positions with a cost of $3.7 million. That would be really nice. Riders say they're looking forward to an increase in staff and hope it will help issues they commonly see on the transit system. I think with more staff, you can decrease the the drug use that go on through, through the trains. There'll be an additional presence on the trolley and hopefully that will communicate that feeling of safety and security to those who are riding our trolley. So what does this mean for you? Well, MTS leaders say if you ride on the transit system, you're probably going to notice more staffing, about 60% more coverage in areas both during the day and the night shift. Well, we do all we can to provide the best security uh, possible along 67 miles of rail, 62 stations and thousands of bus stops uh, in San Diego City and County. Our modest numbers truly limit our presence and our capabilities right now. The vote comes after two deadly attacks at MTS stations in just the last month. One in Barrio Logan, where a 70-year-old man was stabbed, and another in La Mesa, killing a 62-year-old. There's no room for these kinds of incidents, and we want to ensure that uh, people know that when they get on the trolley, they're going to be safe, they're going to be secure, and that there are going to be people there ensuring that they're in good hands. Changes are still a couple of weeks to months away because of the hiring process. Now, MTS says they are working on analyzing creating their own police department. Reporting downtown, Zara Barker, Fox 5 News.